this. I played this on the PlayStation. I played the arcade port of this on the PlayStation. As usual. But, again, you probably didn't see an arcade cabinet of it. So, it's, uh, it's fair game. So, a couple games by Namco. First game is, uh... I think this was, like, one of the first Namco games that didn't get, like, any sort of release in the U.S. A little game called Pac-Man. No, Fozon. Apparently they, uh... Uh, Namco wanted Midway to release this, but they passed. They, uh, they didn't think, uh... They didn't think it was gonna, gonna do that well, and... Honestly, it probably wouldn't have... The avant-garde concept of the 80s, yes. I think they say some good stuff on the, uh... Yeah, they have an English flyer and everything. It's beauty and science. Can you visualize the patterns in your mind? This is not a space game, nor is it a character game. It's an entirely revolutionary new game. The avant-garde game of the 80s. Close on. So this game's whole thing is that you have to you have to attach molecules to your your player. You have to you have to match the pattern that's being shown on the uh, in the background. And if you put it if you put them on in the wrong spot, you have to like hit the button to release them and try again. Uh, let's uh, let's let's zoom in a little more. Uh. Alpha rays. When dis when disengaged, atomic will release beta and alpha rays. On the offensive, atomic will disengage itself and release deadly alpha beta rays. The power molecule will appear from world to one. If Kemic picks up a power molecule, he can attack atomic. So yeah, you're being chased by uh, you're being chased by atomic. Who uh, it's this thing floating around that shoots other balls at you. As each world and step is entered in the form, the formation will become more difficult. The player must recognize the patterns and duplicate the formation as quickly as possible. Your duty is fulfilled when the formation is complete. So there's three steps in a world. Uh, Kemic has two chances to counterattack. When entering the next stage, when picking up power molecule, Kemic with its connected molecules will gyrate about. <laughs> Attacking Atomic with its Alpha and Beta Rays. And after each world or step three, that challenging stage will appear. Push the release button, the molecules will fire at Atomic. Well, did you get all that? <laughs> this game is weird. I've, uh, I, I, I don't think I've ever really been a big fan of this game. But we'll give it another shot. I'm probably going to die to some dumb shit, like, right away. Yes, this is not a space game. Not a space game. If you think this is a space game, you can get the fuck out. This is chemistry. Beauty and science. Cool title screen. Oh, they got the Namco number in the high score, 765. Oh, no, wait, that was my score? Oh, I must have done that in Mame Roulette. I probably said, hey, I got the Namco number. Go find the VOD. <laughs> I thought that was the default high score. How did I pull that off? <laughs> First extend to 30,000, second extend 100,000. The 1983 Namco test is not, text is not very well centered. God damn it. Alright. Wipe out. Step one. So we gotta attach these. Uh oh, here comes Atomic. I did it. Boom, 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 boom. 
Atomic's right on my ass. It said I can attack him at the start of the stage. No, he's popping my boys. There we go. Alright, now we gotta fill in the things on the side. There we go. Shut up, Heidi. <laughs> World one clear. Challenging stage. Okay, we'll just say. Oh, you get. It turns into a space shooter. But this is not space game. The boys are escaping. Also, it's got loud all of a sudden. I'm sorry. Oh, it got me. At least you don't die. Alright, Wordle 2. Nope, that's not in the right spot. Oh, I killed it! Oh, wait, no, I didn't kill it. I died. Yeah, the rotating looks good. It is very smooth. Oh my god, you're so slow in this game! It's another one of those shmups where you're too slow. But wait, it's not a shmup. It's not a space game. Don't you ever fucking call this a space game. Good bonus points. Oh god, what the hell? Okay. I'm ready for this pattern. Okay. Nope. Nope. Oh, I broke my... Broke the boys. Okay. No. Oh! Falling into pieces. Leave me alone! <laughs> Alright. Yeah, now that game's tired of my shit. Uh, let me say give you a warning before the thing splits up. There we go. <laughs> Good. I can kill Atomic when I'm spinning like what? Yeah, I said something about that, but, uh, oh god, uh, what is... Uh, oh god, uh, okay. I'm trying to figure out this pattern. Oh, when you're- oh, okay, I see. Oh, that thing, okay. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Well, uh, I just made a mess of this thing. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hot jams? Well, I got 76,000 on this at some point. Uh, how did I do that? Let's try again. Yeah, I, I get the concept of the game, it's just... Uh, it feels like when you get to some of the later stages, like, you... You kind of need to know the pattern ahead of time, so you're not, like, scrambling to... To like try to piece together what's uh, what it is in the background. Because the patterns don't change, so. 
So, you know, it's gonna reward people that, uh, memorize everything. Mortal 3 odd ones, they make you rip off a lot of the ones you picked up. Well, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> well... First I gotta get to World 3! Ah, oh, you fuckers! Yeah, so was Midway right to, to pass on this? I think this would have been... Some people would have liked playing it in the arcade, but... Fuck. Reset. Yeah, I can't see this being, uh, being like a pole position or Gallagher or Dig Dug level hit. It's certainly something original for the time. But is it necessarily fun? <laughs> That's for you to decide. But 1983 was getting to be a very crowded year for for arcades. Oh, I was spinning. I thought I was invincible. I wish your... I wish your ship moved faster. I feel like that might might have helped things a bit. I'm calling it a ship. It's a, a molecule or whatever. I wish my car moved faster. I wish my air... Oh my god! My airplane died. Yeah, speed up button or something. Something. Anything. Help me out here. It's hard out, out here on these uh, streets. Oh my god. That thing gets to move way faster than me. I'm trying to move out of the way. Shit. That's not the- okay. <laughs> Fuck. Popping off the wrong one. Oh god. Uh, I, I'm running out of time or something. Okay. Uh, take that. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Breaking the boys. Okay, I need to. Shit. <sighs> this is complicated. I'm trying to read... There's, like, a lot of shit to keep track of. Okay, I can attack... I can attack Atomic when this is going on. I'd rather just make the, the thing. Oh, God. Okay. Uh... There we go. No! One more. Hey! World 2 complete. <laughs> You've got extra life noise. I like that. Challenging stage. Welcome to bonus stage! Oh, 
there was another one! I thought it was just one! Oh, I'm not gonna look up perfect now. Womp womp. One short. Okay. Now he's getting a little different. Another one. I shouldn't have launched that. Yeah, you better run, bitch. Okay. Alright, I kinda get it. Oh yeah, I see, they make you shoot this stuff off. Huh. Uh, that's- that's a big fucking upgrade from the last pattern. I don't want to pick that up. <sighs> no. This is stressful! Okay. Grab you. Uh, nope. No. I don't find this relaxing at all. I'm fighting for my life here. Okay. No. Well, give me that. Yeah, fuck off. Oh, fuck. I didn't want to do that. I hit too many. Broke, broke the boys. Okay. Stage is not cleared. Try again. I ran out of time. Oh. I ran out of juice. So I fired off too many of these. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, there we go. Uh, 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 uh. I need to give you more of a warning before the timer runs out, I think. Putting them in the wrong spot. There we go. Oh my god, this is stressful. I'm, I'm firing off the wrong ones. I'm gonna run out of time again. Who is this game for? <laughs> point where I walk away from the machine. And go play Battle Cruiser M12 instead. You're so slow, that's what makes it so hard to like get the uh, the molecules in the right spot. Cause you can't just like zoom over and get it. Um am I yeah, my tires so I can get it, okay. Damn. Well, I guess I never got past round ten, huh? What is this music? This is the fun funeral march for the molecule?
Damn, Fozon Crazy Bus crossover? Well, I see what this game is going for. Um... I don't think it's for me. <laughs> it would it would it would so so help if you could just move a little faster and lock those uh lock those things on like just you know zoom in get it. But the fact that it doesn't uh makes it way harder to deal with stuff than it should be. IMO. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. You're multi backing. Hey, thank you for the raid. How's it going? We just got done playing Fozon. We're gonna do a poll for this. I'm sure this game has its fans. Present your present your case for Fozon. <laughs> Namco sickos. There, there are definitely people out there. I've I've seen people that that seem to think that 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 Namco can do no wrong. That like every every one of their games is a masterpiece. And uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about I don't know about this one. There's a lot of threes. Like, I can certainly see this getting a three just for the the concept alone. Yeah, yeah it's looking like 55% uh, gave it a three. 31% gave it a two. Six people gave it a one. That seems pretty pretty rough. I'm not sure this is a one bongo game. I can respect what it's going for. It's just be, it becomes no fun to play when you get to round ten. That's that's essentially what it comes down to for me. But um, BBH hates video games. He's given this a two. I just. I just don't enjoy it that much. Yeah, I'm anti-science. Science is fake. <laughs> no, I don't know. It's probably one of those games I need to watch like a high-level replay of just to just to see how they fucking do it. Cause I don't get it. I don't know. I don't know how people how people deal with this. Everything's too damn slow. It's a Xevious arrangement problem all over again. Alright, I got a couple, uh... Couple pieces of art to catch up on. The tile screen is a four because of the circles spinning around. It is pretty tight. That animation is pretty good. I'll give it up on that. Anyway, thank you, Turborks. Uh, for... Whoop, hold on. Uh, for, for this new nightmare. Of, of the wolf from Akazukan. I appreciate the comic sans. <laughs> thank you for that. And thank you, Spelunker Man. Oh. <laughs> well, rock and rope is not sp or rock is not supposed to have a K because uh 
You know, it's the bird, the rock. But <laughs> I know there's a version posted without the uh, without the swear. <laughs> but thank you, Spelunker man. Fuck nature. Shoot all the shoot all the trees. Harass the birds. John Rock and Rope's got stuff to do. <laughs> Thank you for that. Or Prince Orkin, yeah, Splunker Band, Prince Orkin. Yeah, the Rock is no K. Because they were they're trying to do a pun. <laughs> <laughs> 